Hello friends. Welcome to Data Empires. In this training session of logical data recovery, we will understand the process of data recovery from a damaged hard disk which has a problem of data redundancy I.O. error. People who are more into computer maintenance sales and data recovery work will be facing the issue where the hard disk cannot be initialized even if it can be detected in the device manager. And even if we try to initialize this hard disk, the data redundancy I.O. error will occur. There can be several reasons for data redundancy I.O. errors occurring in the hard disk, which includes bad sectors, partial head damages, firmware problems, and controllers damages. Here, in this session, we will learn to recover data from a USB drive. First, we will connect that damaged hard disk into the system. And check whether the hard disk has been detected in the device manager. Here, we can see two hard disks. The first one is Dell Backup Plus hard disk. And second one is the main hard disk of our system. Now let us check it in the disk management. Here we can see two hard disks. The first disk is disk 0, and the second is disk 1. Disk 0 is a basic type of hard disk that has three partitions inside it. And this is the system's main hard disk. Second one is the hard disk which is a non-initialized hard disk. Now, we will initialize this hard disk. Here. Right click on disk 1, and click on the first option to initialize the hard disk. A pop-up message will appear on screen, which will provide the option to select the partition style. Because it is a hard disk of 1 TB, we select the MBR and then click on the OK button. At the time of initialization, a data redundancy error message is generated here, and the hard disk is not be initialized. 